On Wednesday, Josie Manuel Barroso traveled for the first time to New Zealand, where he met with Prime Minister John Key in Auckland. Addressing common global issues like the economic crisis and the fight against climate change. We want to uh, renew our engagement with this region. And of course, we see New Zealand as a very close friend, like-minded partner. Uh, we're always looking to extend and build our, our contacts and relationship with the European Union. That's something we'll continue to work on together. The president of the European Commission held talks with other political leaders, like Jerry Matapare, the newly appointed Governor General of New Zealand, of Maori descent. In New Zealand, the function of Governor General, acting as the British Queen Elizabeth II's vice regal representative, is often viewed as the de facto head of state. On the very same day, President Barroso attended the 40th anniversary of the Pacific Islands Forum, where he met with the Pacific leaders and discussed the European Union's role in tackling climate change in the region. We really welcome uh, your, the opportunity to engage with you, so we thank you very much indeed. Uh, you have the floor and we very much look forward to your remarks. As we face critical global challenges, from the achievement of the Millennium Development Goals to the fight against climate change, now is the time to use those relationships to their full potential, to drive awareness of your situation and needs, and to urgently secure the changes your future depends on. Along with his European Commissioner for Climate Action, Connie Hedegaard, he stressed the importance of building solid relationships in the region and joining forces to face critical global challenges. On Thursday, Josie Manuel Barroso received an honorary Doctor of Law degree at Auckland University. I now confer upon you the degree of Doctor of Laws honoris causa. The award recognised his political leadership in European and global affairs and his strong contribution to the field of European studies.